What's brought you personally the most joy and the most happiness in the years you've been doing the voices? Uh, truthfully, mm -hmm. uh, when I entertain the kids at the Crippled Children's Hospitals, uh, just to see them there in their braces, you know, in the in traction and so on, mm -hmm. and just to see them get away from their trouble for half an hour or so is great satisfaction to me. But there's so much trouble in this world today, I think a little humor is needed very badly. And I'm glad I bring it to the kids, Doc. <laughs> <laughs> my son will follow my footsteps. My son, Noel, is, can do practically every voice I do. But he's like me, he doesn't like to copy anybody. I don't imitate people. Mm -hmm. All my voices have been created by myself. And uh, my son is, is very much that way, but he knows. I told him, Noel, you better practice up for me when I kick off. <laughs> Somebody's going to have to follow. So he does everyone very beautifully. I wanted to be an actor. Mm -hmm. Truthfully, I love vaudeville. Mm -hmm. And I used to we'd go to the vaudeville show maybe twice a week to see Jack Benny, never thinking I'd eventually work with him, you know. And uh, it was quite a thrill to start working with him. In 1939 is when I first started with Jack. Do you mind that your people know you, you know your voice, you know your characters, but they don't know you. I mean, you're not, like, recognized on the street. Do you mind not having that fame and the reputation? Well, I did for 40 years until I did that American Express commercial where they showed my face, you know. First time in 40 years anybody knew what the hell I looked like. <laughs> so, so that was, uh, I would have done a free of charge if I knew I was going to get that much publicity from it. Did you miss not having that kind of... Uh, yeah, I, I kind of did, yeah, that uh, not being recognized, just my mm -hmm. voice, and they didn't know who the heck I was, you know until I saw that commercial and they realized that it was uh, me doing those voices. Can I talk to certain voices? Sure. Okay, uh, can we talk to uh, Bugs Bunny since he's... Yeah, best? be glad to, Marjorie. What do you say, Doc? Um, what's the most frustrating thing in your whole life? The most frustrating thing? When I didn't get my paycheck. What happened? <laughs> <laughs> I said, it's not for parking, it's for bugs, and you better give it to him or he'll kill, he'll shoot you. <laughs> what, uh, for Daffy, what, um, what's been the most exciting thing? Well, let's huh? see now. The most exciting thing was calling the crazy rabbit nothing but a despicable character. That's it. You mean the picture's almost over? Almost. Okay. That's all, folks. <laughs>